He is known for his contributions as a composer and chamber organist. He honed his skills through years of study in Vienna, Salzburg, and Nuremberg. His name is Christian Friedrich Witt. In the small town of Altenburg, Germany, a musical prodigy was born. Christian Friedrich Witt entered the world as the son of Johann Ernst Witt, a renowned court organist. Growing up in a household filled with music, it was no surprise that young Witt displayed exceptional talent from an early age. His father's connections and influence opened doors for Witt, as he was awarded a scholarship by Duke Frederick I of saxe gotha altenburg to study in Vienna and Salzburg. During his time in Vienna and Salzburg, Witt immersed himself in the study of composition and counterpoint. His dedication and skill caught the attention of George Caspar Wecker, a prominent composer and music educator in Nuremberg. Witt eagerly pursued further training under Wecker's guidance, honing his craft and expanding his musical knowledge. In 1686, Witt was offered a position as a chamber organist at the court in Gotha. He accepted the opportunity and settled there, dedicating the rest of his life to his musical career. Over the years, Witt's reputation as a skilled keyboard player and Kapellmeister grew, earning him recognition not only in Gotha but also in the courts of Ansbach Bayreuth, Schwarzburg Rittelstad, and Saxe Weissenfels. Witt's musical prowess even caught the attention of the legendary Johann Sebastian Bach. In a twist of fate, Bach was commissioned to fill in for Witt during his final days and perform a passion tide work for the court chapel. This encounter between two musical giants serves as a testament to Witt's profound impact on the world of music. Christian Friedrich Witt, a prolific composer of the late Baroque era, made significant contributions to the world of vocal compositions. His cantatas were known for their intricate instrumental introductions, captivating vocal concerto movements, and the absence of recitatives. These compositions showcased Witt's ability to blend different musical elements seamlessly. One of Witt's most notable achievements was his work on the hymnal called Salmodia Sacra. Considered one of the best hymnals of its time by music theorist Friedrich Wilhelm Marburg, it contained a staggering 762 hymns. Out of these, 351 hymns included melodies and figured basses, with an additional appendix of 12 hymns and 5 melodies. What made Salmodia Sacra unique was the inclusion of established chorale melodies by renowned Thuringian composers of the 16th and 17th centuries. However, it was also believed that Witt himself composed over 100 new chorale melodies, demonstrating his creative prowess and contribution to the hymnal. Witt's compositions in Salmodia Sacra not only showcased his mastery of vocal harmonies and choral arrangements but also contributed to the preservation and expansion of the musical repertoire of his time. Do you want to explore more composers? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.